Prestige Products Thailand, importer of luxury perfumes, recently launched its newest perfume brand at Bangkok's Park Hyatt. I was there to meet the CEO and co-creator Mark Chaya and to discover the true meaning of a fragrance wardrobe. Well, I don't know about you, but when I leave the house, I like to wear perfume. If I'm not, I actually feel naked. And thanks to creators like Mark here and his team, wonderful perfumes like this ensure I'm not going to leave the home with nothing on. Now it's very exciting to see that your range here. And uh, for those who don't know about your perfume, because you're one of the co-creators of, of the company, can you tell me a little bit about it? Um, it's called Maison Francis Kirchhoff, mm -hmm. and it carries the name of one of the most celebrated perfumers of our time. So it's a luxury fragrance house that was founded in Paris in 2009. Yeah. Uh, the company is soon to turn 10 years old. Uh, and we relay the philosophy of a fragrance wardrobe. Uh, Francis Curjean, the perfumer, our in-house perfumer and the creator uh, of this collection, always thinks that it's a bit old-fashioned for a woman or for a man to wear the same perfume every day, as if you're having the same haircut or as if you're wearing the same makeup every day. And fragrance is this invisible accessory that would give a part of who you are uh, to others. So sometimes you want to feel fresh, sometimes you want to feel sexy, sometimes you want to, to feel flamboyant and, and overly sexy and perfume is there to work with every part of your personality. Mm. So when we started the collection it was around the idea for perfume life 24-7 uh, and with a full wardrobe of fragrances that would go from fresh, floral, citrusy or woody and scents that would go with every aspect of your personality. Yeah, it's a very good point actually because uh, I remember my mother having one bottle that she always wore all the time. My grandmother was the same, but if you look at my perfume shelf, I've got at least 20 bottles Love sitting that. there. And it is a very much a reflection of your mood, isn't it? And where you're at and your space and of course where you're going. Right. Um, when, you, when you actually come up with a range like this, I mean, do, do you, I mean, you must have really interesting focus groups, I'd imagine too, to sort of see what's going to work because at different, different eras and different cultures, the, there's a lot of things that might appeal here, might not appeal there. So getting that mix must be really interesting. Part of your question was about different tastes also, Asia, mm -hmm. the Middle East, Europe. And you're right, the taste in Asia is more towards fresher, uh, softer scent, especially when it comes to women's perfume. Women tends to like light florals or citrusy uh, scents. Mm -hmm. If you go to the Middle East, I would love heavier, maybe more opulent and more woody, oud mm -hmm. scents. And uh, the United States would be a mix and Europe would be a mix. Mm. But we never have focus group. We, we simply ask Francis to create and he's a genius of creativity. And then and surprise. Surprising us, yeah. yes, absolutely. So, um, I mean, obviously you've, you've been in Asia for some time. Yes. You're in quite a few countries in we Asia. Are. So now the decision to come to Thailand. Yes. So what prompted that? Uh, as always in life, uh, you meet people and, and when the time is ripe and you, you know it's uh, for us, we tend to go in a market when we are ready and where, when we are mm. capable of providing the best customer experience. Uh, and it goes with the location. Space and location are critical and we're ultra selective company. So when our partners here in Thailand brought to us the opportunity of this beautiful luxury high-end perfumery at M. Cartier uh, mm. called uh, Atelier de Prestige. Yes. And they also brought to us another opportunity to open at CM Paragon. I completely embraced the opportunity and we've decided to start here in, in Thailand. So we're sitting here in front of a wonderful range and I mean I can't, I'd love to talk to you but I really want to, uh, to sample some of the absolutely. fragrances and, to, and if you could tell me a little bit about what you have here. So this is it a looks small amazing. part of, of the range. As I told you, the collection is designed as a fragrance wardrobe. Yes. So what you have here is uh, our aqua collection. Our is aqua here. collection is here. You have Aqua Universalis, Aqua Celestia, and Aqua Vitae. Aqua Universalis is a corner piece in our collection. It's yes. around the idea of extraordinary freshness, addictive mm. freshness, with a top note of citrus and bergamot. Bergamot is a, bergamot, like a yes. great food from Calabria. White Quite an flowers, essential ingredient, a lot of perfume. White flowers and light and musky woods. This is a very popular scent in Asia. It's very fresh. It's very fresh. Mm. It's lovely. Perfect. It's a perfect daytime fragrance, I think. It's a perfect daytime, nighttime. It's, it's a perfume to share. It's, uh, to Francis, it's almost like a white shirt. 
both yes. men and women can wear a white yeah. shirt and it's a very versatile tool. As a man, I can wear it with a tie or a bow tie and a tuxedo or with a shirt yes. and flip flops. And it's a very universal uh, scent. This is why we called it Aqua Universalis, yes. which means the universal water. Well, you can see on the picture, but unfortunately you can't smell through the video camera, but this is beautiful. Then it was time to celebrate the luxury fragrance with some lavish beverage. And I asked him very casually, he was at the dinner party, what do you do in life? And he told me I'm a perfumer. So you're a perfume lover, why? I am, I, um, I just fall in love with the, um, the, the art and the craftsmanship of, of, of uh, the perfume ever since I can remember. I think it, it brings um, uh, a lot of memories to the days, the hour, the time um, of, of um, individuals, uh, person's life, you know. I, I mean, I use perfume according to my age and, you know, how I feel, the mood and when I'm in love, when I'm out of love, when I'm sad, when I'm happy. So it, it actually brings a lot of memories and, and a different kind of sense that, that, that um, sometimes we forget in life. You can find the fragrance at Bangkok's M. Quartier Shopping Arcade.